Hey, it's the Terminion Hero here, and we're playing some more Yoshi's Island. I got 100% on 2-4, so let's move on to 2-5. I see a Lakitu. So there's a fly guy with a red coin in this first segment. By the time we get to a locked door, uh, we want to have two flowers and nine red coins. I don't want to pound through here, because that would lead to my death. Hello. I have discovered a thing by accident. So I wanted to, like, eat the shell, but instead I accidentally kicked it around and it caused me to discover a thing. Was there a thing that way too? No, so I guess I just got lucky. Oh no, it's Lakitu. He's gonna be throwing his spinies at us. I do not approve. Well, we got that shy guy. Which I don't think would have been the kind to fly away, but maybe it would have. I honestly don't know with those guys. Hello! You went kind of far. Just gotta sacrifice my shell to the flower gods. <laughs> Let the tulip eat it. Excuse you! This is a problem. Don't know how I got out of that one. So, yeah, I'm gonna need some stars. There's gotta be stuff above here, right? Spitting out this shell is gonna hurt me. Please let me jump up here so I can get that shell to hit. Or I'm not doing it that way at all. What am I doing? I feel like I have no clue what's going on, but everything is turning out fine anyways. I would really like to get up there. I thought that guy was gonna help me get up there. Please. I don't think there's any more red coins up there, but I don't know. There we go. So this box looks deadly. So I'm gonna try to push it until it is on safe ground. So let's see, two flowers and I need one more red coin. 
I guess that's everything I needed. Oh, that guy's sad now. I got rid of his little spiky thing. Anyways, we've got a new ability here. The train can travel along the tracks drawn on the walls. Accelerate to dodge enemies by using Y. So yeah, in this train segment, we want to get one more flower. I'm not sure what route we want to take. But we can get more train time by hitting the power up again. But if we fall off the track, we fall all the way down. But yeah, you see the drawings on the walls are trying to attack us. Which is nice and wacky. If we get hit, I assume we just get stunned. There's the flower we need. There shouldn't be any red coins on this course, from what I can tell. Yeah, we just get stunned. Alright, so there's where we went into the whole train thing. Now, hold on a second. No, there's nothing over there. Thought maybe there'd be something in that alcove. I'm so glad that was an egg that fell on my head and nothing else. So... Okay, there should be two more fly guys coming very soon with red coins. Turn, ar turn around immediately after fly guys. Secret entrance one is above switch. And I want... Um, four more red coins by the time I go into the secret entrance. <laughs> This guy flew down, so he's gonna try to take off. But I just barely got him in time. So now that those guys are down, I want to turn around. Did I just collect four red coins there? I thought that was only three. Huh. So I assume we want to hit this. I'm right about that. It says secret entrance is above switch. So I assume... ...that the secret entrance is up there and the switch is in here. Which means we don't want to pound this post all the way, otherwise we won't be able to get up. Give me some eggs, please. Maybe we would be able to. Anyways, I'm pausing because I need to look at my notes before I just fall through and miss everything. Um, oh, we don't need to get anything in here. It's just a long fall. Long fall into these caves. With lots of coins to collect that I don't really need, but I'm gonna get them anyways, because they're here. Wow. 
Why did you collect those coins? Because they're there. Isn't there like some Japanese person that climbed a mountain for that reason or something? Or if they're not Japanese, then I just heard it from... Then, they, then the person was just mentioned in Toho stuff or something. I don't know. All my information comes from Japanese stuff. So that's where all my games and everything comes from. Anyways, pausing so that Lakitu doesn't get me. Um, we have another secret entrance to go to. So, secret entrance two is left of switch. So I've got to find wherever this switch is. There's going to be four red coin fly guys at some point here. Also, I hate you, Lakitu. Well, we lost this, because those aren't going to come back, ever. At least I don't think they will. I hate those fly guys so much. Alright, well that's where the secret entrance is. Hopefully those fly guys will respawn once I come out of here. But I doubt it. Run around as our powerful Mario. There's no way they're coming back. No, darn it. I was able to get one of them, but I missed two of them. At this point, I just want to get everything except for those... You know, those two red coins I can't get, which means that stars are meaningless for completion, because I can't complete it anyways. We got bubble breath. So that's where Spyro entered the dragonfly got it from. I see you. You don't look like you'll fly off, though. You're not a jerk like your brother. There's bad thing in that bush. It was a shy guy. Huh. I know I missed two red coins. I hate you. Oh, the other one I missed must be in here. You've got to be kidding me. Yeah, it was in there. Well, I've shown you where all the red coins are, at least, so I'm fine with doing this one off-screen. 
I've at least shown you where all the collectibles are. And that's good enough for me. We don't have to redo the whole level on screen for that. If I missed a coin and I didn't know where it was, where it was, then yeah, we'd have to redo it on screen. Anyways, we've got a bonus game. Item chance. Oh, I didn't read what it was because I thought we had this one already. Just pick a thing and you get a thing. That egg one there, that automatically gives you a full stock of eggs. We haven't seen that one yet. Anyways... So it's gonna be fun doing that level again off screen. Oh boy. Let's move on to 2-6. The Cave of Mystery Maze. Ooh boy. Why does this sound like a level where my notes are gonna be confusing? Hello, you have a thing, and now you're gone forever. Okay, I already can tell where we are. So we don't want to go down too fast because we want to get this stuff along the way. We want to have a flower and 10 red coins by the time we enter a door. So there's our flower. And they kind of let you go back up a little bit. And here's these arrows that'll pave a little pathway for us. And down here we get to the fiendishly tricky part. I mean, first we've got this, which will thankfully give us some more eggs. But yeah, fiendishly tricky part. You got two ways to go. You got down, you think, oh, you might not be able to come back up from going down. And you've got this door that spawned from this, so you're like, oh, well this door probably disappears if I go away, so I'd better go through it. That's a one-way door that goes further into the level. Don't do it. Instead, there's just goodies down here, and you can get back up nice and easily. And we even get a key there. So yeah, I remember getting tricked by that in some playthroughs, or like the one playthrough I've done of this game. And yeah, you can just go through now. So I don't need anything by the second door, but there's a flower and four red coins in the second door. That is a middle rain. Excuse me, what just happened? Where did that bat come from? Okay, so I see. I I'm supposed to throw an egg upwards here. And that brings this down. And I guess I assumed I would do that before continuing on to the middle ring. Either that or I've just messed all this stuff up now. What'll this do? Did that just give me another flower? Okay. 
I'm definitely doing this not in the order that past me thought I would. This is feeling much like my Link's Awakening DX LP. So I'm sure I could go up further if I wanted to. I could definitely go up further with this. Or at least I thought I could. I'm sure I can. I've just got to do a short hop the first time. Or maybe bouncing off this one first counts for the double. Yeah, there we go. This goes to the game hut. I wasn't planning on going here for a long time. I was supposed to have everything but one flower by the time I got to the game hut. Watermelon seed spitting contest. Grab a watermelon and shoot your enemy as quickly as you can. Reduce your enemy's power meter to zero to win. Alright, so we've got a shootout here. Since the guy's not a Yoshi, he's gotta wear a Yoshi mask, like Il Piantissimo with his Pianta mask. Or his whole Pianta costume. Ooh, he got, like, a frost one or something. Well, we won, and now we can get a melon whenever we want to. So if I wasn't supposed to go up there for a while, then where did I expect me to go? I really don't know. I guess I expected me to go up here. Now I'd say it's middle ring time. Yeah, if I collect everything, I'm just gonna use one of my star items at the end. Oh, there's coins there too. I have no idea what order I expected myself to do this in. There is a door here. I am afraid of this door. Wait, no, this door is supposed to be before Middle Rain 1? Okay, I'm going in then. I'm doing this very poorly. So that gave us a bunch of prizes. Now let's jump all the way up here. Well, not all the way up because I've already done that. But going over here should be fine. I think. How much stuff do we have? We just need a flower and some stars. So the flower is gonna be um, it's near the end of the level. I have enough stars. There's 
there's nothing to collect in this area, but there's a flower to collect in the area after this. That thing's gonna jump. I thought. What does that thing even do? I don't remember. It falls? Is that what it does? Yeah, so this does not hurt you, it just pushes you. It's like Squirt's ability in Donkey Kong Country 3. Right, I need in here. There we go, I've got everything. As long as I don't get hurt, we're good, and even if I do get hurt, I can still use one of those star items. Didn't mean to go down there. But yeah, so those platforms, every time you get on them, their number goes down, and when they hit zero, they disappear. Okay. We did this one. Do we get a bonus? Yes, we do. Bonus challenge. Slot machine, great. So we're not getting anything. As expected. Anyways, let's head on to 2 7. Oh boy, I see four red coin fly guys right away and one more later in the level. Yikes. Why do I get the feeling I'm gonna be playing this one again? Lakitu's Wall. Why is it that the ones I'm having to do again involve Lakitu? What is it with Lakitu and, like, red coin fly guys? Anyways, by the game hut, I gotta get one flower and six red coins. I believe I want to go up first. Not exactly sure how to do that. So yeah, there's Lakitu's in walls, like the Lakitu's in pipes in, um, in Super Mario World. We also have big eggs that we get from these fat guys. Was I supposed to get rid of these pillars before? Hello! Okay, that was intense. I'm still supposed to get two more red coins before the game hut, but we don't even have the key, so that makes sense. And I wasn't just being rude calling him a fat guy, that's the official enemy name that Nintendo has given him. I'm not really sure how the big eggs work differently than the normal ones, but I guess we'll find out. I'm still missing a red coin. Is it in here? If I can get down there? Hmm, I'm not really sure where the red coin I missed was. Is it in here? Um. 
That's concerning. Oh, I haven't pounded these down all the way. There we go. Gather coins. Grab more coins than your enemy before the time reaches zero. You've done this one already. Thanks for the boost, buddy! So I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is the first game in the series where there's bandits. A lot of enemies were new in this game. You okay, buddy? You don't look okay. I'm sure I'll be fine. Time will unfreeze for him eventually. Well, you know, if time is already frozen, then I guess eventually he'll never come, but I'm sure he's fine. Anyways, by the time we get to the middle ring, I need one more flower and three more red coins. Get away from me, Mild. That moved faster than I thought it would. There's our flower. And one red coin. Why is this bouncy ball here? What is the purpose? Hello, why is there a switch? I'm nervous all of a sudden. This one doesn't look important. I think it just turned these coins solid. Yeah. Okay, that's fine then. None of those would be red coins anyways. I don't believe any of those ever are. Word. Was that enemy a red coin? I thought I could turn it into one of those flashing eggs and get a red coin out of it. But maybe I was supposed to hit it with an egg. Which means we're gonna be one red coin short. No! I have all the red coins I'm supposed to have here. So by middle rain one, I need two flowers and nine red coins. Why was that guy flashing? I'm just happy I was able to make it up there. Let me in that rain, please. So I guess in this door, there should be another flower. I assume this is one big trial to get a flower. Is there something I can do about you? I guess technically that's something, but it wasn't what I had in mind. 
I thought that maybe the big egg would destroy him. So there's the door we went in before. That guy is there again, and I don't know what to do about him, but apparently we don't need him. Alright, so by the next pipe, I need two more red coins. And they're up here. Got it. Oh, there's gonna be a red coin fly guy coming up. As well as a switch. The secret entrance is left of switch. Oh gosh, we're gonna have 18 red coins by the time we get to that secret entrance. Alright, well where's this fly guy? I'm gonna leave this black here just in case I need it. Well, I might leave it here if I can pound this pillar without hitting it. I mean, there's a bouncy thing I can use, so it's fine. What are you? Alright, so this is where the secret entrance would be, which means I should have gone down. Oh, the, the fly guys... I guess we're doing this first. But the fly guy's below us. And now this one. This is just cruel. Second hole from the left. You're really gonna make me pick and determine... Like, determine whether or not I get 100% based on that luck. Anyways, the fly guy's gonna be right out here, and I'm nervous. He doesn't look like one that would go away. But uh, we got him. At this point, I just need to go back and get everything I missed. That egg was too heavy. What are you? You were a life. I knew there was something in the bottom of that, but I didn't know what. I have enough stars, so I don't need to use that flower. So red coin at the bottom of that. That's... we just need a flower now. At what point do I need to get the flower? We need to get it before we go on to the next transition. Oh my gosh. There's chaos everywhere. 
Is this the flower? I don't know, because that egg was too heavy, but it seems that it causes an earthquake. So yeah, this is just a platform. That was a pow block that turned my enemies into stars. That would have been stars. Oh, I think the flower, I, I think I just saw it over here. All right, that's everything. So now we've got a couple transformation segments. I wrote this down wrong. I have this written down as a mole segment. Are you a good driver? It is easy. Use B to avoid your enemies. So yeah, this is a car segment. I mean, they look sim it looks similar to the mole tank. I kind of forgot about the car. But now it makes sense why they expect you to go so far. <laughs> so yeah, we have this little wheel thing so we can go above guys and get onto these platforms. And now let's go backwards, because we could continue on as the car. But we've got another thing here. Let me go back down again, because it didn't bounce me high enough to do it. But yeah, there's a helicopter up there. I'm not going while these guys are in the way. Oh my gosh. Please. Okay, I guess the bounce isn't determined by, like, how many times you bounce on it. Maybe it's just a timing thing. But yeah, so if you were in the car, you'd come down, you know, further through this path. Just along the ground. And that's everything, so let's finish this before something random comes and hits us. I can't believe I got all those Fly Guy Red Coins. Man, I really wanted to get the castle in this video too, so that way if I screwed up the castle I'd still be able to do the extra stage. But I guess if I screw up the castle, then we're just gonna have to put those levels off until the next video. Well, you know, the one after the next video. Because uh, that's it for this video. So off screen, I'll have to do... What? 2-5 again. And in the next video, we'll uh, finish up the main part of this world. Hopefully the whole world, assuming I don't screw up the castle. So I'm the Terminian Hero, and I will see you then.